YSNlive.com here with Christina Baker, head coach for the Newton Falls Lady Tigers. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, first question here, uh, returning starters, Letterman, uh, we do understand you're a first year head coach, but uh, we need some key names here for us, so. Okay, we have uh, two seniors coming back this year. Olivia Kearson and Holly Hedge. Uh, Kearson's one of our catchers. Holly plays some outfield and infield for us in first base. Uh, we have a big junior class coming back this year. Obviously, they haven't played since their freshman year, but uh, we have uh, Emily Knight, Lexi Drake, Zoe McElrath, uh, Olivia Ballo. Uh, how many? I don't even remember how many juniors I have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Joelle Hood's coming back this year. Madison Powell. Madison Powell. Ashley Harvey. Was it, oh, Ashley Harvey's a sophomore. Sorry about that. Uh, but I know all that junior class was returning Letterman. So they have some experience behind them already on the high school field or varsity high school softball field, which will help, I think, with the younger group that we have. Now, with the season kind of, you know, being axed last year for all spring sports in Ohio, uh, Talk a little bit about how important it was to, to do some summer ball or travel ball. Uh, you know, some of your kids probably played somewhere. Uh, talk about how important that might have been uh, to, because you missed the whole year of high school softball. Uh, I think in just getting that experience being out on the field, I know it was hard to be off and come back on and not have any, you know, I haven't been on in two years or whatever, playing anything for two years would be a hard thing. But I know uh, quite a few of them are playing travel ball or they did play in the summer. Especially that younger group, that junior class, quite a few of them play uh, travel league. They did play over the summer together on the school team, somewhat with the record or whatever it was. So having that experience coming in and that big junior and senior class having that, you know, they have at least been on a high school field, right. other than the younger ones that have not. So I think that'll benefit them in the long run. A little. Also, Sophie Tverick, our pitcher, is coming back. Oh, okay, nice. Okay. Um, talk a little bit about what your expectations, uh, the day-to-day -day basic stuff, uh, you know, what's a motto or, uh, you know, your target and goals for the, this coming up season? I just want us to be consistent and go out and be competitive uh, with them not all playing as a group before. You know, you have half the girls that have played and half haven't. Uh, them developing that team chemistry and I want them to be consistent and be aggressive every time they step onto the field. I think is a big thing. Discipline when they walk out on the field. You know, softball is not an easy game, and to come in three or four nights a week and play a game night after night, it takes a lot of discipline and commitment from them. And I feel like we have that, and I want them to be competitive every time they step on the field and focus. And of course, a very tough league that you yes. play in with <laughs> your teams like LeBray, and of course, you know, the purple and gold of champions. So, uh, can't afford to take a night off. Can't, exactly. <laughs> Tough mental game uh, that we play here in softball. So, uh, coach with YSNlive.com here, thank you so much for your time and good luck this season. Thank you.